become truck driver many want to come to prime a lot of them are confused but there's there are there are few things there are certain things that you want to know as you come out here um trucking and and here i'm about to give you a program some ideas some things that you need to know as you join the company as you join the trucking business as you engage yourself into this journey let's talk about it okay my name is Sergio and on this channel um, the PT Voyager and on over here I've come with this with these few words here at Prime we do have a program how to train you on becoming a truck driver on having your CDL but uh, until right now there's nothing out here officially that will show you what to do or what you're supposed to know what you should know at the end of your program at the end of being on the road and the minimum requirement at, uh, at this company which actually would be fair would be different if you go somewhere else but I am with Prime as of right now I am a truck driver with them I am a trainer and I've come up with these few steps or these few ideas on what you should know before getting released quick reminder um, it takes 30,000 miles um, to be qualified on being on your own for you to be called a fully a class A truck driver here at Prime it takes 30,000 miles which is about roughly six weeks give or take um, considering that on the average 5,000 a mile uh, 5,000 a week 5,000 mile a week so you give give or take it would take you it would take you about six six weeks now is it always six weeks no because things happen a truck could be could be uh, could be could be in the shop um, the weather or home time so many scenarios could happen that you actually goes a little bit more than that or less than that if you guys are actually running as a team you guys are, re are really running hard you could you could do six thousand mile a week okay but give or take on the average it takes about six weeks to be on the road with your instructor with your trainer with your mentor or with the one uh, in charge of you after saying that here is what I have come up with on the first week remember six week on the first week I make sure or oh, you should be able to drive safe is this a truck it's not a car coming on the truck you know how to drive you have your driver license you know how to be safe on the road but coming on the truck they are instructor should make sure that you actually drive safe you know you know what to eat how to eat how to sleep when to sleep and how to be safe okay driving is one thing but driving safe is another thing all right and when I talk about driving is swinging is how you swing how you turn yeah you do it on slow on the curve on the on the ramp how you stop do you stop hard do you slow down before you stop before the sign and all that um and the way you sleep all right is this on this first week is really capital to keep you alive and to keep your instructor your mentor also alive it's really about being safe and staying alive out here on the second week it's all about um the trucking all about the truck whereas you know I teach you or you should know or focus on how to reverse or how to back into duck you see that duck behind how to reverse into duck at the school you learn the alley duck the straight backing and um, the parallel yes out here is totally different 
there's no truck stop no company or nowhere that is actually the same every time that you're gonna pack you always gonna have to apply not just common sense but also what you have learned at school and that's why the instructor will make sure that you know that beside backing up the shipper and the receiver you need to learn and know the proper way in engaging yourself to the shipper and the receiver what to do when you get to the shipping and receiving offices um what you're supposed to to have or uh, like pretty much everything related to compare to the company where you are loading and unloading really important the depart the depart and, and uh, depart and, uh, and arrival specially claims sometimes things does not go well into the trucking business and yes when things goes goes wrong you have to learn or i will teach you how to like how to what to do in or in uh for, for you not to get in trouble and not to get your company in trouble and that is claim if there's any leftover in your truck because they didn't want to take it if um there's a bad product if uh, you have an accident if anything happened yes your mentor your trainer your coach is there to show you what to do and that happened on day week according to their program that i come up with yes i have some notes how to fuel how to shower and how to pick up and drop your trailer super super important eating is one thing sleeping is one thing knowing how to drive is one thing but taking a shower and staying healthy staying clean and um fueling up the truck all this happened on week number two the trailer that you see again on on the side of uh, of, of, of on mama mirror we drop we pick there are certain steps certain things that you have to make sure that you have done you have accomplished as you drop a trailer or you pick up a new trailer really important as before we continue i want to thank you for um subscribing on this channel thank you for liking the video because by liking this video the the, the algorithm on with youtube will actually recommend this video to somebody else that may be needed or that maybe have heard of trucking and want to know what he is to expect as he joined the trucking business thank you for subscribing thank you for liking and thank you for all your comments now the on the third week what do i do i make sure that you know how to pay for your lumpers what we what we use here um is come check it's a special check show it to you real quick that is a come check so it's a special check that you use in paying for unloading or for any fees yes it's, you can you can use your debit card which most companies don't do anymore but the come check everybody use that so i will show you how to use the come check how to pay for your lumpy fees or any fees trucking related also tandem sometimes when you are too heavy or not heavy enough or because of the state law you have to adjust your tandem the tandem is where your tire is from the trailer the trailer tire right there on the little truck sometimes it moves all the way in the front or all the way in the back so I will show you how to adjust that and balance your weight okay that is called sliding the tandem and if you gotta go to the way station or to a, to a truck stop to make sure that you got a, a, a good and balanced weight you need to know how to slide your tandem also on the reefer some trucks have reefer some are dry box some do not use reefer some trucks are flatbed some trucks are uh car haulers some truck are super heavy depending on your department depending on what you haul depending on what it is i do have a reefer meaning i can refrigerate i can refrigerate stuff 
I can haul medication, I can haul produce, I can haul different things and adjust the temperature depending on what the customer want. So also that I will show you or your instructor should show you what to do, how to change it, or if there's a problem, how to make sure that it works properly. That is on week three. Also on the same week three, last but not least, the Qualcomm. The Qualcomm is the computer that you use in the trucking business at Prime. Yes, we use a Qualcomm. At other company, they might use a tablet, they might use a different system, but your instructor will show you how to navigate through the uh, Qualcomm, how to go, this is actually a GPS, how to go through the messages, how to go through um, your hour of services, how to go, pretty much how to navigate and how to manipulate and make sure that you do not uh, do something wrong. Yes, your instructor will show you all these three tips, advices, so you 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 know how to run your business accordingly. The on the on the on the week four, then you jump into the business part. You know how to drive safe. You know what to do. You know how to engage. You know how to deliver. You know how to truck. But it's not enough. You need to learn the business. You need to prevent, act, and correct. That is true pre-planning. So before you go to, a, to to any customer, to any shipper, any any, any receiver, you want to know if you have enough fuel. You want to know the route that you're supposed to take. You want to know what they want you to do before you get there. You want to know where you're going to shut down. All this information is true pre-planning and that is the business part you want to know if in that area there's enough load in that area you will make good in money in that area there's traffic jam not is so all this is true pre-planning also on week on week four he will show you or advise you on how to be to go on home time you might have family you might be married you might have kids or you might have your home time where you want to go to because of other businesses yes on in trucking you do not come out here to do two days and then go home or work in the morning and then go to, go, uh, go home at night unless you are a local truck driver but if you are an otr just like myself or over the road over the road truck driver yes we do not go home every night at least one two three weeks and then we take home time so your instructor your your your, your your coach or your mentor will engage you and will advise you on the proper way when to go on home town, what to do not to be in the hole not to owe any money or, or not to owe any truck payment because you're home time there's a whole advice there's a whole thing that you gotta do that you gotta do and also as you get it released he will show you or he will tell you with your fleet manager the things that need to be done before you upgrade before you get on your own before you have your own truck whether you want to be a company driver or you want to be um, an own operator or you want to be a team driver all this happen during upgrade what you gotta do safe safe safety um, miles wise so there's a whole process or there's a whole detail that need to be complete as you upgrade that another video is coming up just on the things that need to be done before you upgrade here at prime inc i know about prime i don't know about other company so here at prime inc you have to complete certain things before you upgrade and have your own truck have your own company and fly on your own as a solo truck driver i want to thank you so much for taking the time to, uh, to listen on this, to this video thank you so much for subscribing and thank you so much for uh, commenting and advising and sharing this video to other truck driver or other potential truck driver coming to prime you are more than welcome to join the family or else um 
have me as a trainer or at least as a referral if i am available i will not mind i will not have a problem uh training you advising you or go uh, work, working along with you simply d o t e s e is my driver code let's get in touch otherwise my my phone number the public phone number the business phone number is plus one four four three six one nine eight five eight three if you are in the u.s you have your paperwork you are allowed and you have the work permit you are you are legal no uh, dui no violation not no 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 dirty background check yes contact and apply at prime inc put my referral code contact me and let's get you into the business until next time stay blessed Oh yeah, that was four weeks. Remember, I said six. Yes, because for the two remaining weeks, yeah, the, he's gonna have to practice and uh, practice everything that you've showed him. So that, and that's what I'm doing right now. I am in the back of the truck, um, in the bed area, and he got it. Four weeks and a little bit, and a little bit plus. He got everything down. Now he's just performing um, everything that he knows, and anything, anytime that he needs me, calls me, and uh, I'll, I'm right up there. So he's taking us to 90. No concern. The, the truck is moving right now, and we got the job done. He's ready. Two weeks time, two the, 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 the two weeks remaining time, he's learning the proper business and and perfecting everything that he knows already thank you for watching again